Hey guys, Ralph here, and welcome to True Power Weight Loss Center here on Sensational. Sensational Sunday morning. Want a date? Mm. Pity dates. I don't like to mess around the anyway. Got my dates, my sugar water. I'm ready to go, man. You saw a thumbnail. Early morning workout. Fueling for early morning workout. Okay. First one. I actually pop right out of bed. And I'm ready to go. Okay. Not everybody does. Some people go get their coffee. Da, 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 da. Here's the deal. The early morning workout should be just this glorious thing, thing that sets your, sets your mood for the day and everything like that. It is the greatest time of the day for me. I love it. The air is clear outside. It rained all night. The air is going to be clear and pure. It's actually a little, little uh, chilly. It's barely 45 degrees here at 5 o'clock in the morning. But guys, I love these early morning workouts no matter what it be. The uh, baseball field is um, very muddy, so I can't throw any balls today. Just got my book. My book. <laughs> I got some more books, too. I'm a voracious reader. But I just got my uh, bike back from the tune-up, ready to go. So I'm going to go for a 25, 30-mile bike ride. Get this Sunday morning started, man. Anyway. Uh... What you eat during and before and after a workout is pretty much a personal thing. But number one, guys, you do not want to fill yourself with protein. You, you just don't want to do it. That's anabolic. Just, you just, it just gains weight, guys. You don't want to do it as if you're trying to lose weight. Okay? Get some carbs in you. Get that glucose in you. Get that sugar in you. Okay? Glucose and sugar are the same thing, guys. Okay? And now, I don't like to go on a full stomach, so I do not eat heavy before a workout like that. But you need fuel. You need fuel. You haven't eaten since 5 o'clock the day before. It's 5 o'clock. You haven't eaten for 12 hours. You do need some fuel. Now, if you ate properly with the fruit, veggies, and starches, the way that we've done the day before, you're... you're your um, body is full of glucose, okay? So you should be jacked from an energy perspective, but you do need some fuel. You absolutely need some fuel. And on a full stomach, when you eat something heavy, your body goes into digestion mode and all the energy, all the blood flow and everything goes to the body, goes to the stomach and tries, that takes away the energy from your workout, okay? So, especially in the morning, but all day, you don't want to work out immediately after a big meal. You don't want to do it, okay? It just, it just takes away from your, uh, from your energy levels. But you do need a little kickstart. And I do not in any way, shape, or form believe in artificial stimulants. Caffeine of any, coffee, tea, Red Bulls, five-hour energy, of any, any sport at all. So, what do I do? I get my sugar water. Now, this, this is my lemonade. For every 10 ounces, and this is 10 ounces, I do two tablespoons of lemon juice and two tablespoons of, um, two tablespoons of agave nectar. God, it's healthy as can be. Your, your body runs on glucose. Your body runs on sugar. Sugar is a nutrient. Don't be afraid of it. And use it in the morning. And I might go... A couple hours today, depending on if the rain holds off. It's supposed to start raining about seven o'clock. If I go a couple hours, I will swing back, leave this outside, gulp some sugar water every half hour, forty-five minutes or so. And guys, I am my my levels are. I can do hills. I can do speed. I can do anything I want. Today, I love Sunday mornings. It's just so quiet. I like to go for a meander, just sort of explore around a little bit and go around the neighborhood. You take maybe go a little longer. Uh, again, this is very, very suburban. So there are cars out, there are stop signs, there are stop lights and all this sort of stuff. But this time of day, 
all bets are off. You could almost just ride down the, this time of day, and this day of the week, Sunday, you could almost just ride down the middle of the, middle of the uh, road, and it's fine. But guys, this is a wonderful, wonderful early morning workout. Wonderful early morning workout. And now that it's getting lighter, uh, earlier in the day, it's pretty fine, light out at five o'clock here in Connecticut. I'm out at five, six, five to seven, five to eight. Well, be back in time for my wife to get off to work. Now remember, this is this is a uh, weekday, a weekend. Weekday, she's up at about six o'clock. I make her breakfast, blah, blah, blah. So listen, I am eating a little fruit for some dates, some sugar water. I'm all carved up from the day before. Gonna go for a 25 miler. We'll see how it goes. And again, the rain depends on a lot of it. Um, when your wheel and your, and your brakes get too wet, they don't hold. So you can't have that, especially in a suburban area like this. So anyway, that is that. Guys, your weekends are so quiet out in the morning. Everybody else is sleeping in. The world's sleeping in. And you're out killing it, man. Go for it. Sleep, water, fluids, and sugar. Man, sugar in all forms. Starches, fruit. And I will come home. Maybe I'll do a video when I come home, but I will come home and we got some bananas that are need to be need to be eaten. <laughs> They're going bad. Um, so I might make a banana smoothie as opposed to my um, whatever. I'll, I'll do it. Um, I'll do a video when we get back. OK, anyway, guys, enjoy the solitude. Enjoy the solitude of the early mornings. I love it. Meditation. I've done it. I'm ready to go. Haven't shaved, haven't brushed my teeth, obviously haven't combed my hair. Guys, it's just great. Go out and enjoy nature. Love you all. We'll talk when we get back.